Hello, Jesse Good here, and today I'm reviewing the LEGO Power Miners Monster Launcher Polybag from 2009. It has 12 pieces, one minifigure, and it's a Target exclusive, and it retailed for around $3 there. So that was kind of interesting, and it's no longer in print, but now let's take a look at that rock monster. Here is Sulphurix, and I literally only got this set back in the day to get this guy because I did not plan on getting the Claw Digger set, and he's exclusive to that set besides some promotional polybags. He has a nice lime green crystal on him and lime green uh, translucent body, which looks really neat. And of course, you can lift up his head, which is his second piece because he's mounted two pieces. And that's just hinge onto him. And you can feed him the little crystal just like that. And here is the main build of the set. This is it. There's nothing else. There's just a little rock formation and then the monster launcher itself. So you could kind of just fit Sulphurix on there. Flick him like that, and he'll go pretty far depending on how hard you flick it. Very, very simple build. Nothing really going on here, but uh, still works as a pretty neat play feature. All I have is a poly bag itself. I don't actually have the original instruction booklet anymore. I, it's probably somewhere in my closet, but it's so small that I easily lost it. So the Rock Monster Launcher poly bag is just a cheap little poly bag. It's nothing really special, but it's a cheap way to get Sulphurix. And I'm glad that they actually thought out a play feature because a play feature is kind of fun to launch around that rock monster. So that's it for this review. Uh, second hand, this set's around $26, so I would not recommend doing that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell me what you think of this polybag down below, and I'll see you guys later.